It has been a little while later and I am fighting for my life right now just because my cycle started so I'm feeling a little feeling a little bloated but we have to keep moving because I just posted my YouTube video I'm getting ready to um, get that to go live but yeah, I just got done doing my makeup. I am doing a makeup series on my Instagram and my TikTok. Trying out new foundations that I love, that I hate, that match me really good. The purpose of the series is to find a foundation that matches me really, really well. For so long, I have just been doing my makeup and I've just been okay. Or I have just settled for, oh, close enough, close enough, close enough. And granted, everyone's foundation isn't gonna match to the T, but there are some people who can just, it just matches really well. And I just, I don't know. So there's just a lot that I wanna do and I wanna try out and um, and yeah. So there's some more products that I have. Um, like there is a blush and a bronzer set, a trio rather, that I got from one size. I haven't tried them yet. I just Wow. They're literally, I'm just pulling everything out of the bag because I literally just got that stuff uh, yesterday. So at some point I want to try that out. I'm not gonna do that today. That'll just be another day for filming has come out. What I have on right now is the Mario Surreal Skin and that one is so pretty. Hello. Oh, I'm tired. guys I just got out of the shower but I need y'all to see the sky right now it is insane look at this like what this is gorgeous I don't see how people don't believe in God <laughs> I really don't I really don't see how they don't believe in God excuse me to be <clears throat> God is truly an artist. He is he is the creator of creators, like, <sighs> literally. Okay, this particular pair of contacts has been burning when I put them in. So, I'm not even gonna question it. We're just gonna go with a new pair because. Peace everybody, praying all is well with all of you. It is a new day. It is 12th, I think it is. Um, feeling good, looking good, I am good. I went to the gym this morning, so I'm feeling amazing in my body. I'm a little tired, but it's time to kind of get my work day started. I am um, kind of cleaning up just a little bit, and then I have two meetings today. And then after that, I have some errands to run and some other things I need to kind of plan for. I have some Costa Rica things to plan for. Um, so we'll kind of get into that as well. Um, Cooper sheds a lot. <laughs> so I'm like taking this lint roller to my couch cause it's just a bunch of hair on my couch. So I'm doing that now. And then I have my, once my other load of clothes is done drying, I mean washing, I gotta put my bed sheets in the washer and then i have to take some jeans back to uniqlo that i bought on a whim and i hate them i do not like them at all um so i'm taking those i'm gonna go return those and then i have a foundation i need to return to sephora and my mom's birthday is this week so i want to go find her a birthday gift yeah, I want to go find her a birthday gift. So I thought about going to the mall once my work day is done. And I thought about going to find me an Apple Watch. I had an Apple Watch a long time ago, but I sold it because at that time I just wasn't using it. It literally sat in my other room um, for so long. I don't know exactly what it's called, but Target has this little like exercise watch thing that's like a hundred bucks. I thought about doing that as opposed to spending, you know, Apple Watch prices. So I honestly may go that route because I don't necessarily care to have an Apple Watch exactly. Yeah, my hand is cramping up.
I hope y'all can hear me. My dryer, I mean, my washing machine is going off. But I've had this like little mini fridge for a minute. And this is by Kululi. Kululi. Shout out to Kululi. <laughs> I'm not sure how to say that. But they gave me like this little mini fridge. And I've been sitting on this for a minute to the point that I was just gonna like give it away. Excuse me, but the more I look at it, the more I'm like, wait, this is really cute. It's literally a mini fridge. And I've seen people, well, even on here, they said it's a multi, it's an ultra, my words right. They said it's an ultra versatile mini fridge. So you can put like yogurt, water, your meds in it, food and drinks, beauty and skincare, breast milk, on the go, it's lightweight and portable, and it's a cooler and a warmer. Cool. I am almost done cleaning what I want to get clean in the house. I got me some almonds. I'm about to snack on some almonds, y'all. I'm in this thing. Make sure, huh? It's giving, food it's giving pull up Warby Parker glasses, pull them down. Mm -hmm. Taste test <laughs> of the news. <laughs> <laughs> Please so, give us a nice glass of water. Yeah. Right. Hit him with a hard <laughs> head knot. Mmm. No. <laughs> Good. I know that is not somebody in my poor goose. Bye. Grace and peace and good morning everybody. Praying all is well with all of you. Today is Wednesday, March 13th. And I know it's the 13th because it's my mom's birthday Eve. Her birthday is tomorrow and uh, she kind of wanted me to come down today to help her. But I think I'm just going to go down tomorrow because there's things I want to do today. And girl, hey, 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 hey. And I need to go find her birthday gift. So... I believe me and Sunny are gonna be going to the Tyson's Mall today, so that way I can find her birthday gift. Ouch! Not me. Also, when I went to the grocery store the other day, I got these like mini pancakes. I was gonna actually try them today, but since today was core and arms, I'm not gonna do too much, but. I got these and they're the Belgian boys bite-sized pancakes light and fluffy you can pop them in the microwave for one minute or put them on the stove top for one to two minutes no 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 I just finished up this packet of um, English muffins so I'm gonna just eat those I got a new bag of English muffins but like I said I'm not gonna use those just yet um, yeah I'm not gonna use them just yet but yeah the gym was so good y'all it was arm day and when i tell you my arms hurt so bad but it just feels so good getting back in the groove of everything also let me show y'all this so i put a bunch of sticky notes up on the wall so every day that i complete a workout i rip one off the wall and it's just like a satisfaction type deal um and i love it because when you complete something you want to make sure you know you completed it so i just want to rip like my little sticky note off the wall and I love that concept. So I have the entire month of March and some of April. I think I have April, I think it goes to, yeah, it goes to April 11th. Oh, it goes all the way to my dad's birthday. Well, um, it goes all the way to April 11th and that would complete, technically be a little over a month because I started back getting the gym consistently. Like, you know, I switched out my eating and all of that again um, on March 6th. So today is the 13th. So we're well into the process. But um, yeah, April 11th will make a month and some odd change. But yeah, this morning I'm just recording kind of like what I eat, what my morning looks like. I'm just trying to post a little bit more on Instagram, like more con like TikTok style content. I just want to put more of that on Instagram too. But once I'm done making breakfast, I'm gonna sit down and eat, obviously. It literally takes two seconds for my egg whites to cook, so that's why I'll go ahead and make my um, English muffins and bacon, turkey bacon. I gotta count how long it takes for these joints to cook. 
A little bit of pepper and salt, not much. And either I'll do them scrambled or fried. I might just do them fried today. It really don't matter. I'm going to the same place, y'all. Like a little mini fruit bowl. So I'm putting some grapes in here. Mm. Oh, y'all, it has been some time later. I had to take a nap. I need a nap because when I tell you, my whole morning routine is cool, but I be so tired after a workout. So when I eat, I kind of need like that power nap. Low key, that might be my new thing. I, I don't necessarily like sleeping during the day. So if I can, I'm gonna take that nap. I'm about to make lunch. I wanna make some tacos. I actually meant to make tacos yesterday, but we ended up having like a girl's day out because Laysla is leaving for the month. So we went out to eat and we ended up going to this place where we usually frequent. It's called Ted's Bulletin. It's so good. Yeah, I'm about to start my lunch. My lunch, I literally just want some tacos. So I have some ground turkey meat. I have some taco seasoning that I put somewhere. I like having ground turkey. I honestly thought about doing ground turkey, like one of those ground turkey like protein bowls. You know how they have like, you have like the ground turkey or the ground beef. And then you got like your sides, like black beans, corn, some lettuce mix, something like that. I would just have to take the stuff out the, um, out the can. I don't know if I have a can in there. This girl, um, we've been following each other for a long time. And we're, I'm in our close friends and she just posted that she got a boyfriend now. He literally made like a whole, he got a cake made for her and it says, would you be my girlfriend? And y'all, when I say I technically, I take that back. I've been asked like to be someone's girlfriend. One person I turned down, it just wasn't the time. The other relationship, the few relationships I was in, it was kind of like you just started playing house. You just kind of slid into the relationship. And then honestly, my last relationship I was asked, but I feel like I was asked off the baseline of had to have like a whole conversation about it, which was fine. So technically I've been asked to be someone's girlfriend before, but like not in such a romantic special way. And it was so cute. So like when she posted, I'm like, congratulations as if this is like an engagement. I'm like, same thing. I told y'all I'm, I'm being happy for everybody. Cause when it's my turn, <laughs> when it's my turn, I don't hear nothing. I want y'all to be happy for me. Ooh. So I'm cheering everybody on, be in love. Life too hard, life too stressful to not be in love. Be in love, what is wrong with that? Be in love, all the way. Be in love, I'm such a hopeful, I'm not hopeless, I'm a hopeful romantic, like be in love. And like that's something honestly I could talk about because let me tell you something, I don't talk about this too often, but when I say pray that prayer, pray that prayer, I bet you he'll leave. I bet you he'll leave. I bet you he'll disappear, bet me on it. Don't be scared. I, I, I mean, he might not, you know what I'm saying? He might not if that's what the Lord got for you. Pray that prayer though. Baby. And don't just pray that prayer for like your person that you're with, <coughs> your boyfriend, your girlfriend. Pray that prayer about your friend. Pray that prayer about that job. Pray that prayer about everything. I know it's always highly talked about when we talk about, you know, relationships. We always laugh about it because it's like, mm. yeah, I pray that prayer and, you know, I haven't heard from them. Story of my life. I'm so grateful for God because He clears the way for the right people to be in your life. And for that reason, it makes it a whole lot easier letting people go. It really, really does. I'm happy when I see people in love because people deserve that. Like, when I say I be so hyped when people are in love and are celebrating love and are getting engaged, like, I'm so happy for people because we deserve that. Like, everybody deserves that. We've all in life gone through some stuff where we deserve love. We were here to experience love. I've been trying to work on like my plating and stuff. Trying. It's working for my good and it's building my testimony. So glad I made it. Fight of the storm and rain, heartache and pain. I'm still alive, declaring that I made it through. He still has a plan for me. And my plating isn't the cutest, but it's edible. Gotta have some hot sauce, cause that's just my rule of thumb. Really with just about any food. Oh, oh. Whatever. I'm gonna 
dash a little hot sauce on the tacos. Just a little hot sauce on the tacos. I'm gonna just drink me a Perrier for now. Yeah, here are the tacos. I still have a bunch more of the turkey meat. If I still wanna make that bowl, I can still make that bowl. But the only thing I would add to that bowl is a little bit of white rice, some corn, black beans. It would depend on if I make that shrimp or not, but I'm not trying to, the food that I bought is to last me, so I'm not trying to fix all of it in one sitting. I'm trying to make the food stretch. So I'm trying to eat all that's in the house until I can't really cook anything else. Thank you, Laura. Mmm. I tried a new taco seasoning. It's from the Fresh Market, it's from Siete. And I always do mild. And I mean, I still got a bunch more in here. I was kind of scared to keep adding. Cause I didn't want it to be like super salty. Just like that, I became a redhead. But we gotta take it from the beginning because you got reaction. I'm going to finish my tacos and then I'll be back. And good morning, y'all. Y'all see what I got on? I got. I finally bought a skim set. I've been wanting this set for a while now, and I just could not bring myself to buy it because I don't know. But I was in Nordstrom yesterday, and I got. A skims sleeping set why they gotta be $120 because when I say I want every color yeah I might buy they have a navy and a brown but I might get the brown one I want to find a dupe I want to make a video about them but I want to find a dupe first just in case because I know not everybody is ready to drop $120 I don't even want to drop $120 but I put on the credit card I'm up it is Thursday March 14th it's my mom's birthday today Ooh. So I'm traveling down to see her today. Yeah, but first things first, we have to hit our daily deposit, which is going to the gym. I'm just waking my skin up, put me some SPF on, um, brushed my teeth. So yeah, now I'm about to get dressed and put on my gym clothes, so I'll be right back. Well, I'm about to burn my stuff up. I've already had a banana and my protein smoothie. My breakfast is very late, so. Yeah, all of like my raw meat, I'm gonna have to put up here so it doesn't go bad. I'll be darned if anything go bad while I'm gone. I'm gonna put my makeup in this thing. It'll fit, I just feel like it'll keep everything nice and flat. And then I need to do, and I think I'll put skincare. Oh, how I just love being a woman. So many things we need. Hygiene, this cleanser, face oil, face cream, SPF, hyaluronic serum, eyelash growth serum, makeup wipes, toothpaste, toothbrush, contact case, contact solution, retainer, glasses. Okay, oh, <laughs> lip product. Man, we need a lot. Okay, so now for makeup, so when I pack makeup, I like to do it in the order that I put it on so that way I don't forget anything. So, oh, also I bought this YSL mascara because they sent me this one in PR, but this is waterproof and I don't need waterproof every day. So I went and got the regular contour cream, then I do foundation, then I go in with concealer, then I go in with blush and powder, then I do bronzer, I do bronzer, blush, Highlight. I've been really liking this one size bronzer, so I'm gonna take this one too. Then I go in with mascara, so I'm gonna do this one. And I got a new Bag Out Bang mascara, so y'all know the Bag Out Bang is my favorite. So mascara, eyebrow pencil, eyebrow setter, and then my little oh, setting spray. That should be it for the makeup. Brushes I keep the same way, so I'm gonna take one sponge, one sponge, and then so then I know this is highlight blush. Contour, should have washed these joints. I'm gonna just take at least one of these. Yes, this one, but not really. If this fits, that's crazy. <gasps> it does. Cause look how flat it is. Talking about, yeah. I'm doing good, you guys. So far I have gym clothes, sleeping clothes. This is my skincare and hygiene, perfume and body products makeup my bonnets and stuff i put right here so then this side will be the actual clothes i wear i'm literally going to be there today today is thursday i probably won't leave until saturday yeah 
I won't leave till Saturday, so give me a minute so I can figure out what I'm gonna actually wear. I'm gonna take a quick shower and put on my clothes and then we're hitting the road. What's crazy is that I've been here all like the last several days. Girl. And I'm just not picking up the camera. Avery. Let's say hello. We're at my mom's house. We've been staying at my mom's house for the last couple of days. It's it's not hard to hit the jackpot in TJ Maxx. Mm -hmm. like there's always stuff in here. That's true. You know. What these? Mm, not like that. You had your hand. What you do? What these? What you do the ones you had? I put them in there. Okay. Fine. I am fine in the stuff. Now these are fire. Oh, you like that? <gasps> Wait, that's cute. That cute? Wait. There you go, Ma. That's what I'm talking about. Find the gems. You gotta dig. You gotta dig. This is. That's cute. I love that. So many dudes. It go on my little thing that I buy to put in my bathroom. A little shelf. Exactly. And then look That's at this. It has cotton balls on the and front. Well, these have cotton swabs, cotton balls on the front. That would match your aesthetic in your bathroom. Yeah. Let's go with those. Yeah. Go size. Who is it Maybe you can find out. Relax. Our customer ordered a medium soda and I gave him a lot. Yes. I gave him a lot. What's crazy is that I've been here all like the last several days, and I'm just not picking up the camera. Girl. Avery, let's say hello. We are at my mom's house. We've been staying at my mom's house for the last couple of days, and um, I'm getting ready to head home. She's going out, and I need to hit the road. I don't want it to get too late. I mean, it's only like 3.40 right now, so by the time I get home, it'll still be light outside. That's kind of what I'm shooting for, but um, I did a lot of shopping. And I want to show you all the things that I got, but I'm waiting till I get home to show you guys. But we're gonna pack up my suitcase, and luckily, I've ever I had a what? Luckily, I have everything pre-organized, so we just have to put everything back in its proper thing. Like these little travel things I got from Calpac. These little travel cases, so all of my hygiene stuff went in here. So let's go grab. Ooh, let's go grab that. Deodorant, contact solution, face cream, toothbrush, toothpaste, retainer, makeup wipes, SPF, eyelash serum, oil, hyaluronic serum, facial cleanser, lip mask, hair mousse, I think this might fit, comb. And the other things I think I can sit, oh, bonnet. And then I just have body cream and perfume. I mean, I think because those are like earthy tones, I feel like you can kind of go with black. Well, Oh lord. Don't even feel like going no more, D. Oh yeah, so go with what you would normally do. So go with what you would normally do. Something easy. I'm sleepy. Jesus, I can make it. Y'all, I made it home. It's always like that last like 45 minutes to an hour that's always like, bro, am I almost home yet or what? But anyway, I'm home. I did a lot of shopping this weekend and it was a lot of things that I needed and some things I didn't need, but you know, what's the, what else is new? I'm finally home. Oh y'all, let me show you. If you live in an apartment and if you do not have a wagon, what are you doing? And I can say that because I got one now. And when I tell you that joint, like I cannot wait to grocery shop, like full, full grocery shop again, just so I can use that thing. Because when I tell you, it is such a lifesaver when you get a bunch of groceries or if you've got a lot of shopping bags, mind you, I got a lot of shopping bags. And I'm, I'm, I'm a one trip shawty, okay? I like to have one trip and one trip only if possible. So that little wagon thing makes that possible, okay? So I'm so happy I got it, but I have a lot of uh, bags. I wanna go through, through them and show you what I got. 
and it is it's 9 10 at the moment i think that's the actual time i'm gonna assume so now hear me out i want to go to the gym and i want to i'm not wanting to necessarily lift but i kind of wanted to hit the rower um and maybe do some core and then save my heavy lifting for monday because i don't work out at all on sunday so you guys know especially on tiktok i like to do these videos where i do my makeup and all the things but i wanted like an actual mirror mirror where i could see so this one is a lot bigger and this one will sit right there in the mirror i mean right there in the windowsill so i can see really good and i love the fact that it has one magnified side and one regular side just so i could see properly because i always have like these small travel size mirrors i'm always trying to look at something through the itty bitty mirror and it gets annoying so yeah take a picture for a thumbnail next up i did a lot of shopping at tj maxx tj maxx it was hard to not find a lot at tj maxx if you know, you know, because TJ Maxx always has like little odds and ends, what we like to say. So I don't know if you guys have seen, but there's like this Bottega bag. I'm gonna assume this is like a dupe, but I found one and it was literally one left. It has like the whole little thing right here. Like I'll put an actual picture of the actual Bottega bag. That's like $5,000. This one was 24. Get into it. So, I mean, maybe not the real deal, but I thought it was the cutest thing ever. I love that it's big and spacious. I love the chunky handle. I love this little detail right here. I just love it. I really, really love this bag. So I got that from TJ Maxx as well. Moving on, I found this little thing and I guess Checkered is back in, obviously and obviously. <laughs> but I thought this was the cutest little table. It was $13, it was on clearance and I just could not leave it. I always thought, I thought this would be really cute somewhere in the house. I don't know where yet, but somewhere in the house, I can just see this chilling and be in such a cute situation. I even thought about making Avery like a little Jalen B. So for real. I don't, hear me. I don't know where this is going right now, okay? I don't know. But we're still keeping it minimal. I just, it was 13 bucks. Like, you see the red tag? When you see the red tag, you know that joint on sale. It was 13 bucks. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet, but I thought it was the cutest little table. It's actually really low to the ground. I don't know what I'm going to use it for. Point is, it was $13. It was very cute. And we're going to find a place for her. Also in T oh no home goods. I went to home goods as well. I went to home goods today. So all of this stuff is over a course of like two days. So I went to home goods today and I found these super cute plastic drinking glasses. Now I don't need any glasses, but I like these. Now this is like less dramatic. I could not pass up on these brown cups. I just got two. Usually I get a pack of four, but I just got two and I thought these were so nice. I love that hard plastic. I need to get the stickers off the bottom, but y'all already know how the stickers are with home goods. They terrible. Also, you guys, look at what I found. Are you kidding me? It matches my nails. And yes, I kind of sort of got these because it matches my nails. But I could not leave them in there. They were $5 and I love these little mini plates and I thought it was cute. So like when I make my breakfast, I could just show you guys like what I'm eating. And I just thought this was the cutest little plate, the matching little bowls. So I got those. Um, moving on, going back to TJ Maxx, I ended up getting these little powder puffs. I've been seeing a lot of people use these to like set their make, like set their powder. So I thought about getting this. I thought this was really cute. So I got those to try. Got me some Q-tips. I just like these just because of the little container. I can sit these right on my sink. I saw these very cute sunglasses, so I grabbed these. But I want you to see how cute they are though. Like these are very, very, very cute. I love them. Like when you're done up, very adorable. These weren't that much either. I think these were like 10 bucks, 12 bucks. Love those actually. Um, and then what is this that's wrapped up? Oh, I know what this is. So I got me another like, I had already bought a new tea kettle because I told y'all some vlogs back how I burned the other one when I lived at my townhome. Um, so this one is literally like once the water is boiled, you put the tea bag in this thing and it kind of like presses the, um, you know, all the stuff out. You see what I'm saying? And then you pour it. But look at it, it's kind of like this chrome black situation with the gold detail. I thought this was fire. It wasn't that much. Very, very, very cute. So I got that. I need to wash that, honestly. 
but it's a French press. 34 ounces, so. More stuff from Home Goods, which I went to today. So I told y'all checkered is in. <laughs> I got this blanket and it's so stinking soft. Stop playing with me. I'm gonna be wrapped up in this tonight. It is so soft, it's thick. I'm gonna assume it's pretty long, but look at the color. I love it so much, so I got that. And then I just got some more utensils because I kinda needed some more tongs. My tongs that I cook with broke the other day and I had to like literally fix it mid flipping a piece of turkey bacon. So I got some more utensils. I needed a new can opener, so I thought this one was really cute. Hold on, Avery. And then I got some more washcloths because staying at my mom's house, she had these like eco existence brand of washcloths and I was in love. Like the whole time I was washing my body, I said, I need these at home. So I got gray and black. They had pink and orange. I didn't want those. I try to keep it neutral for the most part. So I just got gray and black. More TJ Maxx goodies. Now these are clothes. I'm gonna be honest with you. I may wait and do a haul probably tomorrow after church to show you guys what I got in terms of clothing because I'm not showing y'all that tonight. I don't even feel like it. But I did get these shower steamers. I do wanna try one of those when I get back from the gym. So my mom put me onto these. She said all you do is throw one in the shower, kinda let it steam up and smell good, and then you hop in and do your thing. This here is a bag of clothes. We'll circle back to this bag. I'm not even gonna take it out the bag so I'll know to show y'all. So this is clothes, and I got a lot of cute, really cute items, but I really wanna show you guys in like an actual haul situation. Avery is hungry, I think. Let me get it. Mm. So if you guys don't know, with me moving out here, I told y'all I'm kind of like on assignment here. So me buying a lot of home decor is really not what I'm doing. And if you guys have been following me for a little while now, when I was in my town home, the Lord told me to stop buying home decor. And it's not that that season is over with. I still feel like it's a continued thing even coming here because this is not where I'll be staying for a long time. So yes, I did get another couch because I needed a couch to like have in this space. Um, because I sold my other two. Saying all that to say, a lot of the things that I've been getting have been things that I'm I'm gonna use, like dishware, things like that. You know, I need it, need it. Some things like that, I did need a can opener and I did need a, them little tongs, I did need that. But the other stuff, we'll let that slide. Um, and even that throw, we'll let that slide. But I did get two pillows for my couch and I wanna show you guys that. The only other thing I'll probably end up getting for this apartment is a rug, but it'll have to be a very small rug because my living room is kind of non-existent. I have a very little living room. And so everything that I'll be decorating this apartment with is things that I already have. Give or take something I may just need. And need, I'm using very loosely right now because it's not even that I'll need it. I'll just have to make do to do. But anyway, because I still want to make my little reading nook over there, which I have yet to do. There's just so many things I'm doing. But I'm rambling, but I did get these pillows. I got two, so I'll just show you one, but I did get these two pillows. They're identical to go on my couch because I did want something to go on the couch and, you know, and it'd be really nice. So I did get those, but I'll fool with those tomorrow because right now I have some folded laundry on the couch. And I'm not fooling with that tonight. Um, then I got, I went to the coach store and I found, let me show y'all, the coach store so I could get my mom a birthday gift because I got her these really cute sandals. But I saw this headband and I actually saw this headband online, but they had just put it in, uh, they had just put it on the shelf when I went in there. And I was like, oh my gosh, like these are the headbands, they're so cute. So she showed it to me and I thought this was the cutest thing. It's just a yellow headband. And I mean, I could easily do it with braids. <laughs> Avery, come on. I just feel like that is so cute to me. Like with, with a certain outfit, throw a little yellow headband on, ugh, so cute. So I got that for myself. I'll put that back in here until I'm ready to wear it because I don't want to mess it up. And then my battery's blinking one second. Okay, next up I went to Nordstrom and I purchased a black, their black sleeping sets. Now when I say this, and I was telling you guys about it earlier in the vlog, the sleeping sets are amazing. Like, they're expensive. I mean, they're like $118 like or $120 or something like that for one sleeping set. I mean, it's kind of ridiculous. But I have never, and hear me when I say this, I have never had a sleeping set that felt so good, so breathable. Sometimes I'll get hot in the night. So me wearing a long sleeve and pants set to bed is unheard of. But these are so breathable and just feel so nice. So I'll just show you, well, I'll show you both of them. So I already have a black one that I've worn twice, so I'll need to wash that one. 
but I got the brown set and then they have a navy set as well and they have a gray and they have a white. Now on the in the store they not have the white, um, but online they have the white, but my size is sold out. So I put myself on the waiting list for the white one. I like gray, I don't love gray, but I don't be pressed about getting things that are gray. So I think I was gonna just skip out on the gray one, but I do want the white one. So I got those two sleeping sets. Like I said, I got a black one and it's been my favorite thing Ever. So I was like, yo, I might just have to invest. Cause I don't know about y'all, but I love like a sleeping set. I do it with stuff that I'll get from Target, things like, like I'll always end up getting a set of something. I really, really love it. Um, So moving right along, I, I stopped by one of my favorite stores back home. It's called Philanthropy. It's a Christian clothing brand or clothing store. I got this cute little romper out of there. So check out my TikTok cause I'll probably post an OOTD in it because I love it that much. Is that everything? That's kind of everything. So I didn't do too bad. I did get a few things I wanted. Now the clothes that I ended up getting out of TJ Maxx are very, very, very cute and I really cannot wait to style them. There's some spring pieces. So I'm really excited about those. So obviously my utensils that I'll cook with and my new little dishware, I need to wash those or I just may stick those in the um, dishwasher. I got some PR packages that I need to go through as well. I went downstairs and got my, I had some mail that was piling up while I was gone. They be getting on us about leaving our stuff in the lockers, like not carrying up to get it. So I was like, let me go ahead and get it before I get comfortable. So I went down there and got that too. Put my water bottles up. I also got this jean jacket from that Christian clothing store I was saying, talking about. I'm gonna put that with my other little items so I don't forget to show this as well. Hair, you gotta go back up in a bun. I'm at that stage with my braids, like they in the way. And then let's do extra rinse, yep, okay. <sighs> so I am gonna actually go put my car on the charger and then I'm gonna go do my quick workout at the gym and then I'll come back and shower and then we are gonna be ready for bed by the end. So let me go do that. Like what I got going on right here? I just, I'm all over the place. BRB. Embarrassing, I'm about to trip up as soon as I'm coming about the room. Hi you guys, I am back home from church. Whoo, honey, it's something about, it's one thing getting ready for church, love all the things, but it ain't nothing like coming home, putting on some PJs, getting comfortable, getting wind down. So the agenda now that I'm back home is to kind of straighten up. My house is actually not as bad as I thought. I don't know why when I left my house this morning, I was like, oh my goodness, it's so crowded. There's things everywhere. Now, are there things everywhere? Yes, but it's not as crowded as I thought, which is great. So it's not as much to clean up as I thought I was gonna need to do. All of my dishware right now is kind of on the moody side. So I was like, these will be cute. So I'm going to wash them. So they can be nice and clean for me to use. I was showing you guys these glasses. I actually really love these glasses. I think they're so nice. They're brown, kind of match me. I'm gonna just put all those over there because I need to wash those. And y'all are blinking again, one second. Anyway, I'm back. Um, I didn't even do these last night like I wanted to. These are my little um, shower things. I'm getting you some fresh food, mama. I already made my bed up this morning. Okay, I actually did a lot more than what I thought I did this morning. I really thought I left my house in a complete hog pen, but I really didn't. It's just a couple of odds and ends everywhere, so let's do that. Let's handle that real quick. Oh, you might have like little stuff like this just sitting out, so it's like that. So it's not like it's a lot of junk, it's just stuff. So my, I have some salmon, some chicken, and some shrimp. I took that out because I wanted options because this evening I'll probably end up meal prepping if I have the energy. I already know if I take me a good nap, if I go ahead and straighten up and clean and then get in the bed somewhere and take a nap since I've already eaten, I could get it from a good power nap and meal prep. I'll have the energy. I don't have the energy right now. Only thing I have the energy to do is what I just said I was gonna do, which is straighten up my kitchen. I smell a uh, stink bug somewhere. I'm gonna go ahead and put my gain in here. Now, how do you miss it?
dryer and washing machine is going. The videos, it's a little big, but I don't know. I just feel like that would do better than that little one because I can't see anything. <sighs> All right. Now in the bedroom, we got some clothes we need to hang up. It's just because it's Sunday, so I'm so sleepy right now. Ooh, y'all. I also got these other really cute pants from Zara. They look like this. I don't know what I'm gonna wear them to, but I think I might take these to Costa Rica. I think this would be really cute. I don't know, you know how you wear like a little bathing suit top or something and then you put on like little cute pants. I feel like this might go really well. So I'll keep those in the stash. Um, also, I got this other cute dress from Zara. It's on the shorter side, but I feel like I could do something with this. I love stripes, something with a pattern. I don't wear a lot of color all the time. So when I do, obviously I like to do like a pop of color or incorporate some kind of texture or stripes. And I really, really like this. Yeah, I went running and I forgot how bad my shins will start to hurt when I run. So now I'm kind of struggling because my legs are kind of hurting. So there's that. When I was at TJ Maxx, I bought this shirt. Oh, that's, me. that's right, I gotta show y'all the other stuff I got. Um, y'all. I bought this shirt because I was like, ooh, this is gonna be cute because it'll match these um, Urban Outfitters pants I bought. These are the pants. Now, mind you, they match somewhat. Like they're tan with like the brown stitching, but they're not as identical as I thought. Like the shirt is a lot lighter than the pants. Now, it's not like it wouldn't go. I would still wear this together, but it's just I thought that they were gonna be closer in color. Yeah, at some point I'm gonna have to go on like a closet purge because I am running out of room. Also, I got something else at Nordstrom. Nordstrom been getting all my money. But hear me, I haven't lived near a Nordstrom in ever. So, me going to Nordstrom is a big deal. I love it so much. I bought this really beautiful robe. Um, so y'all know my tan waffle robe. I got a blue one and it's pretty much like it pretty much and but it's blue so I love this light color blue robe when I saw it of course I was like I have to have it okay I'm not mad at it she cute she cute I was thrown off a little bit at first I think because my sleeves of my matching set but it's so cute I do wish the sleeves came down a little bit more but I think because you might do so much in a robe, it might be good that your sleeves aren't like all the way down. Like what if I wanna wash dishes? This is actually a good length. I've been using a different deodorant and my arms have been itching. Now I get my underarms waxed now. So I don't know if it's a thing of just the hair is growing back. I don't know, but I started recently using this other deodorant that I got from European Wax Center. And I don't know if it's that got my arms itching or just the hair growing back in general got my arms itching. Somewhere, I still don't know what I'm gonna do with my little, this little thing. I think this is the cutest little thing ever. So let me handle the kitchen real quick and we'll get to the fun stuff because the kitchen is just kind of a bunch of walking back and forth and I don't feel like moving this camera. I'll be right back. Good morning, you guys. I'm lifting heavy today so I need to put something on my stomach. Usually I do fasted workouts, but today, can't afford that. Oh, you guys, okay. I am done with my breakfast. I'm done. When I tell y'all, do the daggone hard thing, do the stuff, <laughs> do the hard thing now. Cause later, you'll thank yourself later. I promise you, you'll thank yourself later. Ooh. So I washed dishes last night and I meal prepped. So today I'm going into the day like, bet. Food already made, I ain't gotta worry about, oh, what am I gonna eat for lunch? All I gotta do is open it up, crack it open out the container and heat it up. Let me put my clothes in the dryer. I'm gonna do these one more round of drying. I cannot stand, that is a pet peeve of mine is to pull clothes out of the dryer and that joint ain't even dry. Annoying. So I always do two rounds. Now this washer, I mean this dryer, it'll cut off I think after it can like tell that the clothes are dry. I don't know how it does it, but I feel like it knows from what I 
was picking up and putting down. <sighs> I'm gonna go ahead and knock up my shower. I just want to climb in the bed, but I have some work to do. It's my admin work day, so it's not a lot of heavy lifting I gotta do today. And more laundry. Like, just look at this. Are you kidding me? I would actually like to get to it this week and um, I would actually like, get, like to get to it this week and get my closet together and just like clean out a bunch of stuff. But one thing at a time, Jay, you got all week, Lord willing. I get the girl. Avery, please let me hold you. Don't be mean. I love you. I love you so much. You can get on the bed. There you go, my dove. All right, I'll be back. I'm gonna go take me a good old shower, BRB. And I sleep in lessons, I'm blessed. Heck yeah. Every time I turn around, I get ha, ha, ha. All right. Just wanna praise you forever, for all you've done for me. Unto God with the voice of triumph. Woo! Ooh. Okay, so my AirPods said, <laughs> my AirPods said the last, um, the last several days, my music has been too loud. So I have exceeded what did it say? I have exceeded my something. I have exceeded the amount of time that I need to be like having that in my ears. I got an Apple Watch finally. And I think I was telling you earlier in the vlog how I had one before. Anyway, I got an Apple Watch and I'm so happy because I had one before and um, I wasn't using it literally at all. So I ended up selling it to one of my friends at the time because um, they had wanted one and I was like, well, instead of paying, you know, a whole bunch of money, I was like, I have a, a, what? I have one that's in great condition. I just don't use it. And it was, you know, fairly new. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So I just sold it to them and um, sold it to them. I was, well, what's actually crazy is that I was working out during that time, but I just found myself not using it at all. So anyway, fast forward, I was like, well, I want an Apple Watch again because I want to track my steps and stuff. This is my breakfast this morning. I have run out of my egg whites, I've run out of bacon, I've run out of a lot of things. And actually, I actually should make a list of what I need. So I need, I need egg whites. Mm, what else do I need? I'm gonna do the chicken tenderloins. What is up you guys? Y'all, I didn't took me a shower. I didn't have my weekly meeting with my manager. Now, yeah, I had to get me a new bank card because I had some fraudulent activity on my account um, the other week and I don't know why or how it was going on, but I had to get a whole new car. Let me check my account, make sure the money was put back on my account. I've been avoiding it a little bit, not gonna lie. Cause stuff like that, I don't like, like don't be getting in my bank account. It's already enough that we, the world is how it is with money. Like, come on now. But I gotta activate this one. So my card has been activated. Grace and peace, everybody. Praying all is well with all of you. Today is a new day, and I do apologize for this vlog. If it just seemed kind of jumpy, there was just a lot. Woo. There was just a lot going on the last week and some change. We have lots to catch up on, which we will do all of that in the next vlog, which will be soon and very soon. I will not take that long anymore. It was just a whole lot going on that I just, I just felt like I was kind of being pulled. Um, a million different ways and then I had so much trouble with my vlog this particular vlog I really don't know why 
had just been giving me so much trouble. This video was actually going to be like an hour and 30 minutes, but there was so much footage that kept getting lost and distorted. And then when I would try to re-upload it, it wouldn't do like, it was just so much with this vlog. I really don't know why, but I think that's my sign to do a purge of my computer. So I'll do that as soon as I can get this joint exported um, and get it cleared out and make sure I don't delete anything important. But yeah, I just struggled. I just struggled so much with this vlog. But anyway, I'm closing it out. <laughs> I'm closing it out and I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Um, more to come. Next vlog, we're going to be decluttering my closet because I recognize I really didn't show you guys all that I was doing. So I haven't even touched it yet. So mind you, I haven't started yet. So yeah, so there's a lot that we have to catch up on. But there's some... <sighs> it's a lot to catch up on and I can't wait so we're gonna start a new vlog so we can get into all of that because there's a lot of things that I'm doing it's time to prepare for Costa Rica it's time to do a lot of things packing I've been doing a little shopping here and there to kind of prep for the trip um, so I want to show you guys what I got for that like there's just things to do and yeah yeah, I want to properly close out the vlog because I have to run downstairs and go check some mail. And there's just a couple of loose ends I need to tie before the day is over. It is, I think like 6 o'clock, 5 o'clock. It might be 6 o'clock. But I'm tired, y'all. I've been wanting to take a nap all day. But anyway, you guys, thank y'all so, so much for watching the sky. Look at this, y'all. The camera isn't even doing it justice. Make sure you guys subscribe if you're new. So as always, if you're new, I'm Jay. If you're not new, I thank you so much for supporting me with whatever I do here with my channel. I love each and every one of you to know. And of course, until next time, Lord willing, I will see you all in my next upload. And somebody said, I knew, I need a new intro and outro. We're working on it. We're working on it. Like, I'll get something new soon. I know the, the pictures I use like are so many hairstyles ago so i definitely need something new we're working on it i appreciate your feedback we're working on it i love y'all see y'all in my next video bye